Hey everybody, Pete Wyden here at the Epic Ecopreneur. Here we are on a Friday review. Every week or so, I will be reviewing a website or social media profile of one of yours. Leave a comment below with your website uh, URL and or your social media profile or send me a personal message and I'll put you in the queue for consideration for one of these reviews. This is just a tip of the iceberg of what we do in the Focus Growth Group Program where we help you package price market and sell your planet healing product or service here at the Epic Ecopreneur. So send me a message if you're interested in learning more. Today we are looking at Ben Patrick's site EcoAsia. He's done a lot of work on this in the past four or so months since I saw it originally. I'm going to actually type this in here so you can see what happens when we first come. So this little thing spins around which is kind of fun. Um, this image is a beautiful image. It takes a little while to load, so that's something you want to consider. Um, I mean, it's freaking gorgeous. Look at that resolution. It's beautiful. Um, images that take a while to load, it's not a huge deal, but it, it can definitely affect people's experience if they don't have an amazing internet connection. I've got a really fast one personally. So one thing that I notice here is that we've got a lot of options, right? I don't know, like, what what is it that you want people to do, Ben, when you have people come to this website? Do you want them to look at courses and workshops? Are you most interested in the consulting? You got to choose something that you're most interested in them um, taking action on and then create that experience in the initial view that they have of the website for them to take action on something. Um, so we got the permaculture trainings. I know those are a big part of what you do. These images may be able to be um, reduced in size, file size, so that they load faster. I have a fast internet connection. They're still taking a while. So there's a lot of there a lot of information here. Um, it's not too much text or anything, but I think that this could it would go a long way to just making these smaller like making an image about this size and putting the text or button right below it and just having one, two, three, four. I think there's only four things you've got here. And so you could just have them all laid out so people can just see them. I'm on a desktop view with the full expanse um, visible on a 15 inch screen. So, I mean, even on a phone, I don't know how optimized this is for mobile, but which is a really important consideration, but having that all visible in one spot would be really helpful. So I noticed that the courses and workshops and the eco tours, um, there's a couple things that are kind of overlapping here in some of the areas. The image gallery, this is another thing where this could be more of like a slideshow, if that's possible which on your site, which you know with most sites it should be. Um, you know, these are fun images, but at the same time, it's just like this is these could be condensed into something that's clickable like there's an arrow on the side where you can click or um, maybe it's like maybe that this gallery you just have some images at the beginning of your courses and workshops piece you have a little gallery like this is you know all these images in your gallery are already on other pages so I question the um, the need to even perhaps have this tab and also they're, they're not necessarily organized by the experience. So let's take a look over here. Oh, I, I saw this, the new page, of course, you wanna make sure that's not visible to the public. So it looks like this stuff isn't complete. So if this isn't ready, just don't even have it on here or just put a, la a short landing page. It doesn't have to be elaborate, but if this doesn't go anywhere, it's not gonna help anybody, right? And it looks like this should go somewhere. So that one goes somewhere. That pot, This first one isn't going anywhere. So definitely want to make sure that these are happening um, and taking people somewhere where you want to go, where you want them to go. Um, you know, on stuff like this, why is somebody subscribing down here? What are they getting, for example? Um, and also, what do you want people to take action from this page? Like I'm not just going to put in my email if I'm interested in um, eco tours. I'm going to want to click something that's going to take me to a more curated experience or um, take me on more of this journey of what's the next step, right? And make it really easy for people. 
And you know, I might contact you if I'm interested in EcoTour, but the thing is you wanna make this as easy and quick as possible because this day and age with um, the way that our minds work, the way that technology works, we just want it easy. Nam Dong Park, ooh, this looks interesting, this looks beautiful. Um, let's, you know, let's book now or learn more about, uh, you know, join an eco tour, look at our dates or something like that. Having a link there is going to be really helpful. It's going to get you more bookings. So I know this is in, um, for some reason I'm forgetting where exactly you are. I think it's not Thailand. <laughs> it's somewhere in Southeast Asia, I think. Um, do, 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 do. Okay. So if somebody's ordering, let's see what happens here. Tour courses starts for, okay, so you have dates here. You know, I think it would go a long way. Like you've got these tours and the courses and workshops. Rather than having a gallery, I would have a, like a events, um, have, have a link to a calendar on this website so people can see like plan it out visually of like when things are happening and just like have a little image on the calendar perhaps of like mushroom experience January 24th and um, that's going to go a really long way for people to be able to understand how this might fit in with their plans because if they're just on this page they might not they might think this is on demand or they might not even know when it's happening and they might just leave the page if it's you know, they're not really sure if it's going to line up with their itinerary, for example. So make it really easy for people to see when these things are happening rather than having to click extra stuff, um, you know, link to link to calendar, having your events calendar up on one of these tabs. You don't need that gallery, in my opinion. Um, involved, contact. So I think that's it for now. Uh, let's see if you got any social media. Um, and granted, I could do a much more in-depth uh, review of this. That's something we do in the Focus Growth Program. And meet our facilitators. Where was that? Might be in the About Us. And this, this, you know, this long form scrolling down. It would be so much better if this could be side by side, and people don't have to scroll down as much, and they'll see more of what you want them to see. So let me know. If you guys have uh, particular questions about your own website or social media account, how to get people to take action and say join your mailing list or book, um, book an event with you, um, sign up for your course, sign up for your consulting, let's talk more about this. I'd love to hear your specific questions in the comments below. Also comment eco below if you're interested in seeing the new focus growth framework workshop I've put together. It's a free workshop on the framework I use in our programs to help business owners activate and monetize their business to continue furthering the mission uh, by bringing in income. So I appreciate you guys coming around. I'll see you on the next Friday review. Thanks a lot, Ben.